Today I'm going to show you how to create a super easy Valentine's Day look. So let's get started. First step is to apply an eyeshadow primer. Not only will this give your eyeshadow something to hold on to, but because we're using reds and pinks, it will prevent the lid from getting stained, which can happen occasionally. Next, taking a blending brush, I'm going to apply a nude color. Applying this all over the lid will set the primer in place, once again creating a barrier to prevent any staining, but also creating a powdery finish for a soft blend. Keeping that same blending brush, I'm now going to take a transition shade and apply this back and forth in the crease of the eye, working from the outer edge in. Try keeping your eyes open and looking slightly down in a mirror to see the shape that you want to create. If you have hooded eyes, remember not to skip this step. If you're struggling to find the perfect mid-tone or transition shade, try using your favorite nude lipstick as a guide. If you know what shade of nude lipstick you'd wear with this look, just find a corresponding eyeshadow and it will work perfectly in the crease. Now taking a slightly smaller brush, we're going to be taking our ready pink color. We're applying this on the outer edge of the eye, so the outer quarter to outer third, slightly then into the crease as well. Keep your hand low when you're applying on the outer edge, and then bring your hand slightly higher as you work into the crease. This will prevent you from blending it up too far. Remember that your mid-tone or transition shade is always the highest shadow. Sticking with that same brush now, we're going to apply a black. Because we still have a little bit of product left over on this brush, we're actually going to end up mixing them together. This will make sure that the black works really well with the pinky red. Apply this focusing on the outer edge of the eye only, and then you can slowly sweep it upwards, working across the pink to deepen it as you like. On the rest of the lid, I just applied a cream eyeshadow. Tap it over with a brush or your fingertips to cover the rest of the lid. Try focusing on the inner portion of the eye and then blending across. To add a little bit of sparkle, I'm going to use a glitter liner, but I'm going to apply it with my fingertips, gently tapping over the top of everything that we've already applied. This will evenly disperse the glitter. Using glitter liners means there's no need for glitter glue, which can be kind of tricky. Finish off in whatever way you like. Liner, lashes, maybe some shadow smudged underneath the eyes, whatever you prefer. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. You've been watching The Makeup Chair, and I'll see you next time.